Welcome everyone to today's class. Today we focus on how to calculate the attrition rate in Microsoft Excel. My name is Gabriel. And just remember, this is only a part of our data analysis class. Let's get started with my Office 365 Excel opened. You see my attrition data, which have the quarterly data, the end of the previous month headcount, new joiners, the ex staff who exited, and end of the current month. So we find out how to calculate the end of the current month headcount by using the if statement. You start with an equal sign, open your bracket, then use the logical test by using if the new join this is equal to zero, then the whole thing should be zero. Then we look at the headcount of the previous month plus the new joiners minus the exited staff that will give you the headcount for the current month. And that will represent the beginning of a new month. You just use your drill down function and bingo, you're there. So that same formula we just use our autofill and we stretch it down then you have it now let's get to the main thing the attrition rate how do we calculate the attrition rate you always begin with an equal sign and please don't forget to hit the subscribe button let's move on so with our equal sign we begin with our if statement as you can see open your bracket in the same way if the exit stuff is equal to empty or zero, then it means Excel should give you zero. That has everything to do with that if statement. Now the real thing, the attrition formula here will becomes the number of exit staff divided by the average headcount. By the average headcount paid here, I'm looking at the headcount per the previous quarter and the headcount per the end of the current quarter. As you can see there, your bracket close and make sure you also include another bracket and you hit enter and bingo the magic happened it's just five percent my people this is how to do the attrition rate in excel simple and straightforward this is the how powerful your knowledge in data analytics and nature analytics will help you do some of these things within some few minutes don't forget to like hit on the like button and leave your comments below for more of this insight see you in our next class my name is gabriel 